you know, two years ago, I think uh, you were in the press conference where I was talking about the ATI acquisition uh, in Sunnyvale, and a lot of questions I got were, hey, are you guys getting out of the graphics business? Well, it's two years later, and, you know, it's nice to be back on top again with the 4870X2, which, quite frankly, is the unheralded single card leader, and at $549, it's, it's pretty awesome. And, you don't have to take our word for it, uh, just take some of the reviewers' uh, words for it. Uh, now, with that said, though, you know, while it's nice to have the bragging rights at the high end, quite frankly, the business is made on the mainstream part. And what you'll see is you'll see the 4000 series architecture uh, move down uh, in, in the price points as, as we move forward. And, you know, it's not just about discrete graphics, too, it's about integrated graphics as well. And we have some really awesome things that uh, we're delivering for back to school and holiday that we can tell you about. U.S. retail markets are really interesting in, in that over 90 percent of U.S. retail notebooks use integrated graphics. So, you know, in the States we're really focused on, on giving the best experience on that and other parts of the world uh, discrete plus the integrated to give that hybrid graphics experience uh, really knocks it out of the park. We offer what's called hybrid graphics. So there are some manufacturers that will have the, the um, 780G on the motherboard as well as a discrete solution from ATI called the ATI Radeon 4850 actually working in parallel together where you get about a 70% a bump by having uh, two cards in there. The Intel solution doesn't use both of the GPUs. What happens is you, you pull the plug and you go on integrated, you plug it back in, and you have discrete. And we have that same functionality uh, as well, but we go the extra added benefit where the uh, integrated GPU and the discrete GPU are working together. So it's kind of a kind of a notch above.